Hey friends and welcome to my review of TT Artisan 35mm 1.4 for Fuji. Look at it, it's so small. They were nice enough to send it to me and now I'm gonna share some of my thoughts. Okay, before we talk about the lens, let's check out the box it came with. This is made of love. Every manufacturer should do boxes like this. It makes them more fun to open. Okay, hard facts. This one is an APS-C lens, which makes it equivalent to 50 mm on a full frame. It's only 180 gram. And if I'm going to compare it to my Sigma 1424 from Sony, look at it. This one is a beast. This one is a beast. This one is just a bit smaller. Because of the size, I would say it's perfect for the traveling photographer, street photographer, and portrait photographer. People outside, they won't get frightened when you run up to them with this small lens. You can run and gun. Um, uh, maybe not gun, but I hope you understand what I mean. Another good thing with this is that it's really robust. It will survive a few falls. I mean, you can juggle it around. I don't recommend it, but uh, it will survive because it's not made of plastic. And that's really nice for a lens that's this cheap. It's only $73 on Amazon and I will provide a link in my description. The focus ring is a bit is a resistant, so you won't hit it by accident. And the aperture ring, it clicks. I love the clicking sound. Just listen to this. There is one negative thing with it. It's a manual focus lens. If you like me, you hate manual focus. All other settings are on manual except for focus. I always shoot autofocus. This one. I had a I tried this out for two months. And it was a hit and miss for me. On Aperture 4.0, it's sharp as a razor blade when you hit the focus. Wide open 1.4, it's hard to hit the focus at all. So, okay, instead of me babbling around about how sharp it is, how good the colors is, the bokeh, let me show you a few photos where I actually hit the focus. So in conclusion, I really recommend this lens, especially if you are a photographer on a tight budget, if you like to travel and don't need heavy equipment, if you are a street photographer and if you're a portrait photographer, if you don't mind the, the manual focus, especially at aperture 4.0, it's really sharp. At 1.4 wide open, it's always hard to, hard to hit the focus. So uh, if you like this short review of this lens, please leave a subscribe, a comment, and uh, until next time, 